There you go, folks. Bleeding Edge reactions, as always. And always, you know, you know, if it's a Bleeding Edge reaction, that means that the co-host of the MCU's Bleeding Edge YouTube channel and podcast, myself, Jeff S., true knowledge, as I'm known to some and uh, lesser to others, I'm here once again to lead this son of a bitch, to lead, get it, to lead this show and whatnot. And collaborate with my friend Josh on round two of our Bandmade reaction so far. We already did on set. Now we're going to drop Bandmade No God on Josh for the first time. And I've also never heard of the song either. Or listened to it at all either. So I have no idea. I'm going in totally wide open here. Um, and we're going to go for a really authentic reaction here. Um, and basically, as always, shout out. Big shout out and much love to the bandmate fandom worldwide, US, whatever, all of you. Y'all are my people. Um, you know, and um shout out to Bandmate themselves for being so fucking awesome. And shout out to Josh for, you know, being a TBI survivor that's brave enough to put himself out there publicly and whatnot and everything, you know? And Record with me and everything and whatnot. Make content. Make reaction videos and shit when, you know, it can be kind of hard when you're a traumatic brain injury survivor to feel comfortable or confident sitting down doing something like this. It's not easy sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So, just in that alone, you know, I compliment Josh and appreciate Josh joining me on this video reaction collaboration to ban made no god. And I'll then just go ahead and throw real quick again to Josh and let Josh go ahead and do his intro. So I would say what he's got to say for himself. Then we'll get into the song. It's all you, brother. Okay. Uh, I am a, t a severe traumatic brain injury, brain injury survivor. What? I am 37 years old. My name is Joshua Daniel Garnett, and I, I'm a, I'm a music I'm a musician. I play guitar and sing. I've been in a few bands, so I'm looking Fuck forward you, to this Bumble. band Fuck made you. again. I've already lis listened to their their musical onset. Great onset uh, and onset. Sorry, onset and. Honestly, look, watching the musicians, they're pretty talented. That's right, baby. Representing right here. Representing Bandmade, baby. You see that big-ass poster behind me? I ain't playing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I'm all in for Bandmade, baby. I'm all in. So what's up, man? I'm what's the, What's the deal, Josh? Are you going to end up being a Bandmade fan by the end of this shit or what? It depends on what what the lead singer sounds like. I'm, oh, I'm a, I'm a singer as and as well as a, as a musician. I sing, I can sing and play guitar. Okay, hey, let's do this. Hey, 
gotta wait, brother. You gotta wait. The so, the music is too loud for 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 us anybody to be able to hear your voice. Oh, I can be okay. I can I can barely hear you when you talk above the music, but it's okay. I was going to stop the video no matter what anyway. So, so listen. Obviously, very quickly, like it's it's very clear, right, that this is a totally different kind of sound than onset. Right. Right. With with vocals, yes. I was no saying, no I was, no no the music the music. Oh yeah, definitely. They're not they're not just messing around. They actually have they have this planned out each piece each piece. I know what that's like because I'm 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 a musician. I've been there, I've been to plenty of bands. So yes yes. Uh, I was saying that I I was reading I was reading the words. Yeah, the words. The words are very powerful, very positive. I like I like the words. Their lyrics are typically very positive. That's their vibe, and they will throw some English in there too. Like you know, Psyche will throw some English in there here and there. You know, too. Like you know, once in a while, they usually every song they usually do a little bit of English. Um, so. It's kind of a weird song. I mean, compared to Onset, it's a totally different style of a song, you know? But so far, were you able to detect the um, harmonies with Miku and Psyche together? Oh, you mean the backup? The harmonies, yeah, between Miku and Psyche. Yeah. I've, already, I've already complimented the backup, Jeff. The backup, I, lo I love the backup. Miku. The backup the backup vocals are awesome. Miku. M I K U. Miku. Miku sings amazing. She's a great backup vocalist. She really is. She's great. She's very she's almost she's almost kind of underrated. She has she has really great energy. It it, it takes a certain a certain thing in the backup vocalist because they can just a a good buck of backup vocalist will will just hear something that needs to be in the song that goes with your goes with your vocals and then do it and it makes this whole song even better and of course there has to be a proper blend of the voices too with the lead singer as well you know what i mean that's also important you know it's how well they blend together like when they sing together you know what i'm saying and i think you'll notice probably like over time like i have that Psyche and uh, Psyche and and Miku have a very very good chemistry, singing with each other, bouncing off of each other, and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like they have really good timing. Um, but let's get back into it.
Yes, brother. Uh, I was I was just gonna say this. It's 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 different being a being a musician watching live music. I kind of judge them, judge them right off the bat. I'm I'm watching everything the mu the musicians are doing. I'm like, I'm watching and I'm li I'm listening to it and I'm like, that was good or that didn't they, take much. They have they have really good body language. They all do. But Psyche, I like I like, them. I like them, Jeff. I Psyche, like them. Psyche's really good. She's got great stage presence. She really does. That's the lead. Yeah. Psyche. And she, yeah, and she's very beautiful. Like I told you, you know what I'm saying. She's very attractive. You know, tall, long black hair. You know what I mean. You know, she's just very pretty. You know, um, she got a great voice. Are you surprised at how at, at how she sounds? Is she not what you expected? Actually, she's she's a she's a lot more she's a lot more strong vocals than I thought. You know, she's really to the point. She don't she don't just she don't do a lot of ah you know long drawn out drawn out notes. She's just straight up blah 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 really really quick. She got a lot you know, of attitude. a lot of attitude. I like it. I like it. Me too. I dig it too. That's it. That's the end of it. Well, What'd that, you say? that was pretty badass, Jeff. Yeah, man, it was great. I enjoyed it. I liked it. No God was great, folks. We enjoyed it. Would you? So, what do you think, man? What do you? What are your final thoughts on No God? What do you? What are your final thoughts on Psyche? Now that you got your first taste of Psyche. I love the, I love the vocals. I love the vocals. They're very strong and very straightforward. Very straightforward and very good. Very good words. Read the, read the subtitles, people. I do. If, I do. If, if you can't if you can't understand, read the subtitles. The words are the words are very inspiring. Very inspiring. They are. They are most definitely. And so. Who was your favorite in this one? Which which maid? The drummer. Akani still? Still, yeah. Well, you know what? That's a good choice, my friend. She had she had nice she had nice little drum solo in that in that song. Eventually, I'm gonna play a song with, uh, for you where she does like a long drum solo. I will. But, um, yeah, I mean, hey, folks, I like No God. It's definitely a very different type of sound than anything I've ever heard with Band Made before. Totally different than Onset. Um, and, essentially, uh, again, I just want to point out that I'm making an effort right now to bring in friends of mine and fellow TBI survivors like Josh, because I am a TBI survivor, whether some of you know, you know that or not. I know I don't really talk about it, on the shows and everything and whatnot, but but it is a big part of my life. Um, I'm just very blessed in that I fit into neurotypical society still. You know what I'm saying? Like I I um I I evolved to a level of functioning where I can still fit in with everybody else. And so you know what? I'm in a way I'm very blessed in that way. You know, like a lot of other TBI survivors don't have that. You know what I mean? And so exactly yes, and so. You know, basically, I just really want to make an effort to involve my fellow TBI survivors in this bandmade series because I feel like 
bandmate is such a unifying thing. Like, it's such a unifying sound and band and chemistry and all of it that, you know, it, it brings people together. And, you know, I'm hoping at the end of the day, just like with all my Bleeding Edge reaction collaborations, that people like Josh will end up walking away as bandmate fans by the end of the shit. When we're done, he's going to be like, looking up bandmate on his own. Yep. What do you think? What do you think the possibility of that is, Josh? I've already, I've already thought about it. There you go. You heard it, folks. My phone's right here. I'm looking it up whenever we're done. All right, folks. That's it. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. We love you. Shout out to the bandmate fandom. Billy Edge. Reactions. Out. They're going to kill me. I told them to send me a video holding an object and start nodding. Anything is a dildo when you really put your mind to it. There's no such thing as too large or too sharp. Every time you stop to question yourself, I want you to tell yourself, I can and I.